Hey, um, I've had quite a few questions about how to get the terrain generation plugin up and running from an empty project, so I'm running through the steps now to show you how to get going um, in the project. So I've created a new Unreal Engine 4.15 project, C++ project. I've got it open here in the editor, and here's the Visual Studio project. So I'm just going to close it down. So the first thing you need to do is install the plugins into the project. So in the demo project folder, create plugins. Now you're going to need to install the dependencies, the first of which is the runtime mesh component coders so using whatever git client you're happy with just to check it out into that plugin folder done now you need unreal fast noise which is the noise plugin i've made so again clone it into this plugins folder it's done Finally, you need to clone the cache gen plugin. Plugins are all done. Now, go back to the root of the demo project, right click the U project file, and generate Visual Studio project files. When that's done, fire up your Visual Studio solution. You might notice I'm skipping through some parts of this process um, in editing, so some things may take longer depending on your machine. Okay, first thing we need to do now is go into plugins, noise, and you should see Unreal Fast Noise plugin. So click Enable, and then down here you need to enable the Cache Gen plugin. Do that. Close the window. Close the project. And now if you relaunch it again from Visual Studio. Okay, now you should have all the plugins enabled. In the content browser, you go to view options, make sure you have show plugin content ticked. And then when you click the top level folder, you will see cache gen content, and there will be a sample level in there that you can open. Just open the sample level, and you should be able to just hit play. And there you go, the uh, plugin is all working. In the second video, I'm going to start going over how to build a scene from scratch. Um, it will be coming soon. Thanks.